This here's Homer to Homesteader again on the educational front. Still on task number two. That is uh, mulching the orchard. Uh, the first one, if you recall, was setting up this here YouTube channel so we could uh, try and provide a fun and educational way about moving out and kind of being organic and self sustaining and living off the grid. So I'm gonna update you a couple things I didn't tell you, I think, in the last video. You can see I'm not good at this here educational stuff, more at the humor stuff. But Horatio asked me to make sure and mulch these no closer than three inches to the tree trunk. So I'm gonna have to move that back a little. Uh, but he also had these here lower areas around the tree, which I figured we're gonna be for the water to pool up in there, collect as much as it can. Like I said, the sandy soil lets it run through pretty fast. So I figured out it takes about one and a quarter wheelbarrows of dirt to go around the outside edge of where that sand hill he had around each of these trees. And it's gonna take me about two and a half to three wheelbarrows i got a, a really shallow wheelbarrow here full of leaves to mulch with he said not closer than three inches to the trunk in a circle three feet in diameter around the tree so that it's six inches deep he may come back and correct my work but that's the best i tried to do another point i made about we have really sandy soil this here i dug out of the forest and i tried to get all the top soil as you can see, is relatively rich, but it's still very sandy. And we're getting this here broke down. We've got some grass there, but it's also got some broke down leaves in the very little bit. And uh, as you can see in this bit here, if you get your shovel a little too deep out there, it gets into just the sand. So I'm trying to get this kind of stuff that's nutrient rich uh, to put around the trees like i said we also put some down in around the roots uh, but to put around the trees so that nutrients will go down and wrench the soil and help our trees to grow so again i'd like any comments you got on growing trees in sandy soil doing things organically using what you got available to make yourself self-sustaining out on your homestead this here has been Homer the Homesteader, working on task number two for Horatio. Thought you'd like an update on property.